Hey guys, Maggie here from the Mediterranean Kitchenette and today we're making bamies. What's that? It's a Greek style longevity okra stew. This recipe is super healthy and blue zones inspired. Plus, it's really delicious. Let's get started. So we're gonna need half a kilo of frozen okra. 250 grams of baby potatoes, one medium eggplant, 200 grams of tomato pulp, five tablespoons of olive oil, six slices of sun-dried tomatoes, two tablespoons of chopped parsley, one large clove of garlic, 100 grams of feta cheese or any white goat's cheese of your preference, 3 teaspoons of salt and 300 milliliters of water. That's it! Alright, so first of all we're gonna chop the parsley and we're gonna dice the garlic, the sun-dried tomatoes and the eggplant and we're gonna cut those baby potatoes in halves. And now we're gonna use a large and deep frying pan and we're gonna use five tablespoons of olive oil to simmer that eggplant for about five minutes over high heat. After 5 minutes, we add 2 teaspoons of salt and give it about 5 more minutes. It should get some nice golden color, guys, just like that. And now add the garlic and leave it for one more minute. Just make sure to be stirring all the time. And let's go ahead and make some space right in the middle of our pan to be able to pour that tomato pulp inside. And once you do that, you leave the pulp for about two minutes. We would love to hear from you. Please leave your comments below. Thank you so much, guys, and all the best from Maggie and Eva from Athens, Greece. All right, so time to add that okra. Okay, we're gonna add it and we're gonna combine it really gently. And now time to add the parsley and the sun-dried tomatoes. Just leave half of the parsley, guys, okay? Uh, so we can garnish the dish at the end. And now we give it another stir and we add 300 milliliters of water. And finally, we add those lovely baby potatoes. And one more teaspoon of salt. And that's it. Now you guys just switch the heat too low. You cover your pan and cook it for about 45 minutes. And now that our stew is ready, time to add some crushed feta cheese. And the rest of the parsley. And of course, some super healthy fresh olive oil. And guys, both of us here, mom and myself, we really hope you enjoyed that okra stew. And please let us know if that was the case. I'm gonna link all our other healthy and blue zone inspired stew and soup recipes for you guys in the description below. And on our blog, which is called The Bright Side of Life, you can find so many delicious, healthy and easy Mediterranean diet recipes. So feel free to check it out too. Thank you so much for being here and for your support. If you fancy, subscribe for more. And thank you so much, guys. And I see you the next time.